it's still early days as far as uh, you know exploiting the full potential of recognition practices is concerned. Uh, actually, it's a low-hanging fruit. It's something so basic uh, to the needs of uh, uh, people across the levels that we just have to uh, spontaneously make it available. We uh, have to make sure that um, we link it with some priorities of the organization. Line managers will never engage with any initiative or effort that HR folks uh, may make unless they find it linking it, supporting their deliverables, that is line managers deliverables. Therefore, what we in HR fraternity need to recognize is that when we structure our recognition programs, these are nicely tied up with what the business is trying to achieve and then create support systems, easy to understand processes so that line managers can practice uh, these without any effort, too much of an effort or complications. Actually, what uh, my experience has been that whenever line managers have tasted the benefits of such programs and practices, then it has been a self-perpetuating kind of a process. Uh, even when HR folks are not around, then the line managers themselves want to you know, engage with it and, and, and derive full value of it. So it's, it's a, it's a win-win for, for, for the employees and for the organization. And like I said, uh, this is an area that is waiting to be fully exploited for the, for the business advantage and for creating a great workplace for the employees at large.